So in my life, growing up for the last three decades, uh, both my parents have been ultra supportive, super generous, and the qualities that really reflect on um, both my parents, my mom and my dad, is that they are hardworking, just hard workers. And this isn't just reflected in using brain power and, and using intellect to try to gain and apply knowledge and higher education and, and values like that, but also in just sheer hard work, uh, you know, physical labor, manual labor, working minimum wage jobs uh, to make ends meet and, and just kind of always dreaming big, uh, doing the best with, with what you have and what, what has been dealt. And so I, I really respect them for that. And everything I say about my dad here in this uh, running clip video essentially is, is also reflected in my mom. They have a lot of similarities. And, you know, going back, you see my dad and mom, they built the house that he grew up in uh, essentially with their bare hands. My dad had designed other houses and built them and, and worked in various types of, of construction and other odds and ends types of jobs. Uh, that was pretty hard physical labor uh, for not a ton of pay. And then furthering his education, pursuing a master's degree and, and working in education for over 30 years. So he was a uh, science teacher at public school and he was a maybe a little biased but he's he was a great teacher uh, he's a great teacher and just some kids would be a little embarrassed that they'd have to be in their parents class and they'd have to learn science from them but i wasn't embarrassed i was proud i was proud to be uh the teacher's son and to be in my dad's class growing up and i think my siblings were as well so my dad worked really hard at his job and i saw the long hours he put in after school, before school, waking up at 5, 5.30 in the morning uh, for a long commute to work and doing lessons plans and grading papers on the weekend, uh, as well as always making time for us, you know, cooking in the kitchen, preparing healthy meals, supporting us academically and athletically in all the different activities that we did from piano lessons to running in track meets and cross country and soccer games and uh, any other extracurricular school activities. Uh, my parents made time and, and supported us in that and I can't thank them enough because uh, it really helped shape my siblings and I uh, into our adulthood and it definitely was something that I would never take for granted. So it's very fortunate to have that support and to see the qualities that my dad had uh, that he had applied over the decades through teaching, but also through other jobs that he had and work around the house and just always dreaming big, always, you know, trying new things, trying to innovate, trying to, to help others. He was always pretty athletic uh, growing up, but he got more and more into running later in life. And now at age 62, uh, he's out there rocking it on the trails and getting uh, the same sort of experience that I get distance running. Uh, this goes for both my parents and uh, it's really it's really cool to see. So this one goes out to my dad who just uh, with my mom really laid the foundation and essentially made it a heck of a lot easier uh, for me to be able to do what I do now. Ships are launching 